right? So we know that it's a tangent. We don't have any center point. So there is no question of radius. But we do have something. Well, in this question, they want us to find all the missing angles or maybe the angles marked with letters. Let's just go and find everything. Right. Now, I would like to start at this point here. What is the reason? Why do you uh, say why I should start here? I got a triangle RPQ <coughs> where two sides are equal. They only told us in the sum. And I know one angle as 35 here. The base angles, we are looking at isosceles triangle base angles. Right, key stage 1 and 2, they play a very important role, please. So it's a 35. I'm looking at this angle here as 35. That's going to be 35, please. Right. Now, two angles we know. <coughs> Is there a way we can find this angle, the top angle there? Come on. It's 35, 35. Another angle I'm looking at in a triangle. They add up to 180. So that's a 35, it's 35, they add up to 70, the total should be 180. So how much should I get here? That should be 110 degrees please, right? That's a 110, 110, 35, 35, 70, together 180. So that is the reason why I wanted to start at this point. Because we know more information, right? Now... <clears throat> Can we find M? We know this is 110. Is there a way I can find angle M? That small part there, that angle I'm looking at, right? The green line, watch the green line. It's a straight line, so you know what is M now, right? Straight angle, 110, that should be 80. Oh, sorry, that should be 70, please, right? Now, 70 add 110 is 180. Now, there is another concept I want you to concentrate on. If you turn the picture like that, watch very, very, very carefully, please. Triangle PQR, there is a line that is extended, watch there. Now, this is called an exterior angle. Exterior angle equals to interior opposite, right? Exterior angle of a triangle is interior and then you add those two that we got in this case should be 10, 20, 30, 40. By the way, don't count these ones, please.